Hello everybody, back here for my quick little fast forward of my painting technique. Um, not really sure if this turned out as great as I'd hoped, but I'm going to go ahead and kind of let you know what I did here. What we have beginning, um, I've already got my four or five coats of that really crappy yellow paint on there. Then this right here is a gray paint that I have. I think this may have came from an auction where I picked up a box of paint for like a dollar, a bunch of leftover stuff. Um, nothing really uh, fancy. I think it's actually might even came close to freezing, so it's not the best paint in the world. But what I'm doing here is I'm actually taking and just putting down a coat of the gray paint, leaving it fairly thick. Um, I'm coming back in, and what this material you're seeing, the cloth wadded up, is actually um, more like a long underwear type material. And I'm just wadding up in a bowl, and then I'm taking a little like quarter turn to half turn twist as I work my way through and pull off the paint to leave the pattern. The One of the things I am having trouble in the process of doing this is figuring out how far to come with each set of paint and then the deal, because the paint's drying so quick on me that I'm getting these weird little spots in it. So on this piece, I tried to run it a lot farther down to try and get the leftover, like so I don't get the weird lines in between each layer of gray paint, and it doesn't turn out that great. The one thing I'm doing here at the end is I'm taking that same piece of cloth with that checker pattern, and if you notice in the middle, there's like a little, like a screen type, you know, checkered square pattern on it. And I'm really liking the look of that. The one thing I would recommend highly if you decide to do this project with the same technique is to use a separate rag of the material to lay on top. So like right here, this is getting so heavily coated in paint that it's not, it's not pulling up as good. It's not leaving the pattern like I like. I just, I don't know what I was thinking. I could have grabbed another piece and I just didn't. So if you're doing this type of um, technique, highly recommend changing out your rag a lot more often than I did. Also, I'm wearing gloves, you can see, because it's an extremely messy process. So I'm happy with the results, not ecstatic with it. I'm also making a back and forth pattern here, kind of which way you want to go. It makes no difference. It all kind of turns out about the same. So just do whatever works for you. And I want to say thanks for watching. Have yourself a safe and wonderful day. And good luck.